Tim? I know Tim's insurance is cheaper, but is it the right plan for you? Do you even know how both work? Not really. I just thought it was cheap. Okay, let me help you with that. Let's start with the difference. Term insurance is a type of insurance policy that provides coverage only for a specific period of time. In this case, one year. Within the year, if something happens, you are guaranteed with a payout. If something happens after that year, you won't get anything. As for investment link policy, the coverage is up to when you're age 100. There's many more years that they're covering. It's no wonder that terms is much cheaper. Since they are covered for less. Yay! Okay, you may be thinking, if you need to extend the coverage, you can always renew, right? Well, not entirely true. Say if you get term insurance and during the coverage, during the period, you are diagnosed with a certain <laughs> illness. It is not guaranteed that you will be able to renew the policy since your health has a problem and you are at a much higher risk to make claims on the policy. They may reject your application for renewal for that reason. And due to the existing health condition, it's going to be much harder for you to secure a new insurance plan. Even if you can renew, the premium for your term insurance could also be increasing due to age. Oh no, I didn't think about about that. Another thing, would you like insurance that is flexible and can adapt to your needs from time to time? If that's the case, investment link policy is worth considering as it allows more customizations of benefits compared to a term insurance. Under an investment link policy, you can customize your coverage on your specific needs. You can include critical illness, medical, disability, and even accident coverage. Not just that. From time to time, when your needs change, you can adjust the coverage accordingly to better suit your needs. According to the stage of life that you are in, this is unlike term insurance, where you are able to make changes to it after signing up for the plan. But here's the thing, life is always changing, right? But then you will need to adjust your insurance plan accordingly. And investment link policy has the flexibility to adapt to that. Wait, but I heard the investment link policy is expensive because they added the investment into the insurance. How does that work? Okay, let me show you some fall insurance there's something called cost of insurance which increases according to a person's age as you can see the older a person gets the cost of insurance becomes more expensive for investment link policy a portion of the premium will be used to pay for the cost of insurance while another portion will be used to invest on your behalf while this means higher premium initially the accumulated amount will have to offset the increase of cost of insurance over the year making the premium more affordable in later years in my opinion this is really helpful as well because imagine when you're retired with no income and you need to pay for an expensive insurance premium, it's going to be tough. If you're using an investment link policy, at least that accumulated cash value can help you cushion that burden. Aside from that, the cash value also works like a savings. Oh man, I think I will have to reconsider my choices. Yes, Tim. Remember, not everything that's the cheapest is the best. What's more important is what you need.